In this program, we're going to learn about the monogastric digestive system. Animals with a monogastric digestive system have one simple stomach. A digestive system is the system by which ingested food is acted upon by physical and chemical means to provide the body with absorbable nutrients. Even the smallest animals need to eat and drink. In some unicellular creatures, ingestion occurs at any point of the body. Because they have no mouth, these single-celled organisms ingest nutrients through a process called phagocytosis. Phagocytosis is when a cell takes in a large object that it will eventually digest. These creatures do not have a digestive tract. They store the ingested material in structures known as food vacuoles, where the nutrients are absorbed and waste products are then eliminated through a temporary opening in the cell membrane. One of the first types of digestive tracts was the gastrovascular cavity that is found in cnidarians like jellyfish and sea anemones. In a gastrovascular cavity, food goes in and waste comes out that same opening. Food enters the gastrovascular cavity where enzymes break down the food used by individual cells. Waste material is then ejected through the same cavity. From the gastrovascular cavity evolved the alimentary canal, a one-way digestive tract with two openings. Scientists believe that the first animals to have the alimentary canal were microscopic worms called nematodes. From nematodes, the alimentary canal evolved, resulting in many different types of digestive tracts. Arthropods are invertebrate animals whose digestive functions take place in specialized cavities that are connected to form a continuous canal. The alimentary canal includes a foregut consisting of the mouth parts and esophagus, the midgut or stomach, and the hindgut where undigested food is excreted through the anus as feces. Virtually all vertebrate animals have a digestive system with an alimentary tract. Different species of vertebrates have different digestive systems. There are four basic types of vertebrate digestive systems. Avian, monogastric, ruminant, and pseudoruminant digestive systems. Digestive systems of animals have adapted to the various different kinds of foods eaten, the methods by which food is obtained, and the energy needs that an animal needs in order to survive. Animals like humans, cats, dogs, and pigs have a monogastric digestive system. Mammals with a monogastric digestive system are better adapted to eat foods high in nutritional value, which are highly digestible, high in energy, and low in fiber. The main parts of a pig's digestive system include the mouth, esophagus, stomach, small intestines, large intestines, and rectum. Food enters the digestive tract through the mouth, where the mechanical breakdown of food begins. Teeth chew and grind food into smaller particles. The saliva moistens and softens the food particles while an enzyme starts the digestion of starch. Saliva also contains digestive enzymes. The tongue pushes food toward the esophagus that carries the food to the stomach. Enzymes in the stomach begin to break food components such as carbohydrates, protein, and fats into smaller molecules. A few of these molecules are absorbed from the stomach into the bloodstream but most pass to the small intestine where further breakdown takes place. The large surface area provided by villi in the digestive tract helps to absorb nutrients into the blood and lymph. Villi are small finger-like projections on the inner wall of the intestinal wall. The next step in the digestive tract is the large intestine. Its main function is to absorb water from the digested food material. The terminal part of the large intestine is called the rectum. This part of the large intestine expels the waste products of digestion through the anus. Animals have different digestive systems. The monogastric digestive system found in mammals is a system designed to get food in the body, digest the food, and absorb the nutrients necessary to live.